Whoa. This looks really menacing. Um, get, there we go. That is so cool. This In the dead world, the snow is flying up. And then it's falling down in the normal world. Apples don't fly up! Well, in the dead world, they do. Um, anyway, so this place, I remember being um, really uh, one of my favorite areas of the game. Again, just like the... Um, just all the different platforming areas. I'd say, like, it almost like... Almost even better than the... Uh, um, than the dungeons is like the, almost the lead up to the dungeons with like the forest del chivo and the tool tree and uh this mountain are really awesome although this is basically a temple it's just not called a temple anyway so uh let's just murder these enemies a little bit just 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 fuck them up just a little bit and uh let's try and uh hit okay that's a death bit interesting to know uh let's just keep going Lots of high-rise stuff in this place, just like the tool tree, except now it's snowy! Yay! Uh-oh. Uh, dark energy to teleport. Oh, god. Okay, these, this is brand new. This is not good. There we go. Well, they still can't... They still can't escape the pile driver uppercut combo. Nope. Okay, that's like a... That is an instant death combo, it seems. That's awesome. Wow, they didn't even get a chance to teleport. So lame. Oh, God. Um, I can make that. I'm one! Ah, oh, if only we could ledge hang. Okay. Yeah, there we go, just barely. And sure, let's go up here. Why the hell not? God, it's crazy, that power-up. It's so much fun. Um, oh, sweet, a stamina chunk. I figured there'd be a secret in there. It, uh, like and and you think like that power up seems really broken? Just you freaking wait. There is still a pretty major one that we have yet to acquire, that we may acquire here, and that one's definitely the probably the most ridiculous and the most fun power up to use. Just because you you get it and you're like, oh my god, really? Um, okay, these new skeleton designs are terrifying, by the way. Okay, yeah, he's teleporting. That son of a bitch. Pile driver. <laughs> Aw, I really want to do that true combo like we got to come up with a name for the combo the pile driver and the uppercut like how about the pi pile cut uh upper driver driver pile cut i don't know let's just call it the fuck em up <laughs> why not the fuck em up oh god the supreme fuck em up the uppercut into frog slam uh so cool, because you, you can really just experiment with any combos you want in this game. This game has more combat potential than Melee! And has Guacamelee in the title! Why isn't this at EVO next year? Anyway, let's just continue to just destroy... I just... The combat's so much fun in this game! Like, we're like... How many hours in are we here? Like, we're around like four or five hours into the game at this point, and like, the combat is still fun. Except when the enemies dick you over like that. Ow. I should probably focus on the, the knife guy, because he's fucking me up a lot more than the... I tried to dodge that. Okay, time to fuck these guys up. There we go. Oh, God. Oh, thank God, I, I regained health from by using Intenso. There we go. That felt badass. Okay, just a quick look at the map, and no, we can actually head back. Into here. Oh, God. Uh... Well, first off, this is beautiful. I'd probably say graphically, this is probably the most beautiful area in the game. Just snow worlds are always so beautiful. Unfortunately, we can't actually do anything about that yet. <laughs> so uh, we'll have to come back there later, because I definitely know there's actually something quite good across that pit. Uh, so first off, let's just keep heading up this mountain. First off, second off, and third off. That's the main thing, is heading up this mountain. And again, I, I like beating around, like I'm just beating a dead horse at this point. But great soundtrack in this game, just really good. Just every time a new mu music track comes up, 
you really get excited. And, oh, God, I love the platforming in this game. It's so much fun. You get to do cool stuff like this, like, all the time. And it's just really, really cool. It's, like, you think that was cool? Check this out. Boop, boop. Yeah, it's so fucking cool. It's just, like, the level design is just tailor-made to make the platforming just, like, enjoyable. Like, it's just a really fun game to, like, actually do the platforming on. Well, I mean... Just you wait until we get to the really hard, optional, dick move platforming segments. But again, I'm a platforming genius. I think I'll be fine. That that sucks that you don't get invincibility for doing their special moves, but I guess that'd be too broken. Oh my god, I, these guys are just completely dicking me over right now. There we go. And get out of here, and... Yeah! <laughs> I wanted to pile drive right into them like that. Also, you can cancel the uh, the wall run with a wall jump at any time, which is really nice. You don't really gain, like, crazy momentum from doing that, but, um... I'm seeing stuff on the map, but I'm thinking that might just be a bottomless pit. As you can see on the map, like... This is another place where, like, there's bottomless pits everywhere, so it's just, it doesn't fill out the map entirely, and it bothers my OCD, but it's fine. We should be fine. There's a pe person on this mountain? It's Keyboard Pants Guy! Wait, really? No way. Okay, well, this is definitely another branching path, because, again, in the base game, you just you kept heading up the mountain. Okay, I'm not going to believe him, and I'm just going to actually head to the top of the mountain and see what lies up there, because I don't believe him that the bridge is busted. I just, I need to satisfy my curiosity. It's the same with the desert, actually. When they when they make you do the detour, they're like, hey, the, bri the path to the, to the desert is blocked, and, like, they don't actually show you the block. You can actually go there and see that it's blocked with all the rocks. But they don't tell you... They just tell you that it's blocked. It's kind of weird that you don't get to see for yourself. But, okay, yeah, the bridge actually does appear to be out, unfortunately. And we can't make that in the slightest. So, yeah, okay. Guess we're doing another detour. But it's a detour to a new, uh, a new world. So, I guess I shouldn't complain that much. Or we could just head up this way. Why not? Uh... Huh. Okay, I don't think that's actually possible for me right now, so I'm just gonna jump down here. I can't, that's a shame. I can even wall run from, like, the pixel at the top and gain the same amount of momentum, that's funny. Um, there's a chest right there, son of a bitch. Okay, good, I was just gonna say I landed on that platform, so I'm probably gonna spawn at the bottom, but I didn't, thankfully. And, uh, yeah, I, I just, this, the size of this room, you, you figured they'd hide a chest there. So I guess we're actually leaving the mountain already and heading to Pico de Gala, so, oh boy. We And we're fine. <laughs> hey, what's up? You just saw me plummet from the sky, and I'm totally fine. Uh, Pico de Allo. Okay, oh, my voice cracked there. Whoops. Um. Oh, there's a skeleton here. What's up? It's the same guy. Weird. Um. Oh, that's funny that Cambo Santo is. Oh, that's interesting. So Camo Santo was like completely destroyed in the. Oh, it's on the. Oh, that's so cool. That's a really cool idea. The village is in complete ruins. It's in complete ruins, but in the dead world, it's it's completely fine. Presumably all the people that died in this village just rebuilt the village in the dead world. That's really cool. Honest, that's cool. Interesting. Okay, so it appears to be the, another actually new town, which is nice. So let's uh, let's talk to some of these townsfolk. Oh, really?
Um, uh, are they going to be on the map, or do I have to... Ugh. Okay, well, no, normally I'd be like, oh, that sounds like a lot of work, but he does say there's goodies in his house. So he says supplies, specifically, so maybe it'll actually be, be more than just your typical, like, here's a heart piece or something. So, um, sure, I'm going to head back to the canal, and I'll just super cut to the five Aluxes. Okay, I'm back in Pico de Gallo, and, uh, yeah, I looked for them a little bit. Like, I, I did manage to find one of them. Like, I found one... Uh, in the room up here, for instance, but I've quickly discovered that there's a little chicken maze, and there's a purple block inside the frickin' chicken maze, which means that I guess that the purple blocks are actually broken by a chicken ability, which I don't remember, so I think the purple blocks are actually new, too, and I just, I have a feeling that I, like... That just really seems like a place where they put one, so it's put one of the five creatures, so it's not even worth it, honestly. Maybe I'll do it later, maybe I won't, I'm not sure at this point, but, like, I'm, I can't do it now, so I just feel like there's no point in going through the whole thing for a side quest I can't complete right now. Um, especially if some of the other ones also involve purple blocks. Anyway. It's fine, it's probably just some heart pieces and stuff. Hey, you've tied two. No, I haven't. Not even close. <laughs> You're dead, though. Not me. <laughs> uh, it, is, it is quite nice music. This place does have good, good music. Those inky black eye sockets. It's the most creepily romantic thing I've ever heard. <laughs> anyway, what's through here? Uh, never mind. Never mind. This actually leads right to the desert. I'm an idiot. Uh, let's just keep going then. <laughs> okay, so th that's really cool too. Like the lava is flowing up, but it's not even f like the volcano is deactivated in uh, in the real world. It's really cool, like art design for between the two worlds. It's not just like oh, there's lava in both worlds though. That's for sure. Um, it's cool, because it's not just, like, oh, one world is a little bit darker. Like, it is, like, in this case, like, it's a completely new background, completely, which is really nice that they went to that extra detail uh, for the for their dark world counterpart in this game. Unfortunately, we can't get back on that platform that we dropped from, but we can still... We can get across this area now that we have access to Dimension Swap. And we can get all the way back up here... To the big platform. Oh god, I just dicked myself over, except I didn't, because I'm genius. Yeah, okay, we're all the way back up here. I'm sorry, I just wasted your time. Let's just hop back over here and actually uh, progress with Pico de Gallo. Uh, if, if, we, if we could land on the floor. Oh my god, we're still not on the floor. There we go. And, ooh, okay, the actual volcano. In we go. 